in terms of reflecting for this month, I, I've been reflecting on my parents' journeys. Both of them are immigrants. And I also try to take time to dive into stuff that I don't know. Um, even about our history, I know that we spoke that I was like, what about like Canadian soccer? And what about that history in terms of being black? And I remember my sister and I were watching soccer. I remember seeing like Charmaine Hooper at the time who's a baller. I hope that we can get this, this video out to her. I remember her just scoring goals like with ease. Um, but not having so many black female players playing for Canada. Uh, and if you look at our, our national team now, it's more of a representation of the people who play soccer in the country. Well, honestly, what's happening right now is, is immense uh, for the country. I think um, it's just great to, to show the representation of Canada. You know, we are built of immigration, right? So we are, we are, we are changing things. We're, we're doing things um, in, a, in a different, in a different manner. You know, one player that, that always uh, stands out to me uh, in their journey is, uh, is Julian de Guzman um, and his brother, uh, Jano. You know, they had to, they had to get out of Canada, uh, create their own pathway. And uh, those, those guys in the past are pioneers. So I think um, it's it's a great time, and I think uh, especially with seeing the amount of um, different cultures on the on the national team and black players specifically, um, I think this is the most we've ever had by far. Um, and to see the talent that we have, and to see what we're doing, to see we're about to go to the World Cup, um, I mean that's pretty impressive. Just bringing in different cultures ultimately has made Canadians realize that we have so much. Uh, multiculturalism in our country you're seeing the guys these guys uh, burst through the scene and it gives uh, hope to the future generation <laughs>